Well, not only are traditional school supplies like paper and pencils needed for this upcoming school year, but for those opting for virtual classes, so are laptops. News Channel 7 Sam Martello caught up with one local man who's pitching in for those who are without. The house behind me has been turned into a workshop for building laptops that will be donated to kids that need them for this upcoming school year. What started off as a Facebook post has now turned into a full-blown operation with a 40-person waiting list and 100-plus requests beyond that. I just thought uh, in today's day and age for a kid to get a laptop to be able to go to school with, their parents shouldn't be thinking about things like whether they can buy food or whether they can put gas in their vehicle and he shouldn't be offering to do work for school tools. Paul Jones of Panama City wanted to make a difference in the lives of kids now to give them a chance at a brighter future. The people that I'm trying to help are the young people that we're going to turn all of this over to. Uh, I want to prepare this generation to be able to do those things, uh, to fix those things, to get some things right that we got wrong. The parents of the children that are receiving the laptops are stunned by Paul Jones' act of kindness. It's amazing. It's amazing. It's, I'm, I'm surprised there's somebody out there that is willing to do this for any children. Take their time, you know, their effort, you know. Amy Adkisson's daughters are two of the lucky students who've received laptops from Jones. Fourth grader Nevea Thomas believes having a laptop is important for her education. Then you can learn and to learn better. So when you can't go to school, you can have a laptop so you can learn and read math and do everything. The joy this brings to the kids and parents makes it all worth it for Jones, he says. This is uh, greedy of me. I get something out of every smiling face that I hand a laptop to. And a parent who goes into tears or gets upset because they can't believe it's something they're not going to have to focus on. So it's kind of greedy. It feeds me. Jones is in need of donations and more equipment. So to help out, you can go to the Meet the Needs Panama City Facebook page, search Laptops for Kids, and there you'll be able to find the GoFundMe link and more information. In Panama City, Sam Martello, News Channel 7. Now for anyone able to send Paul Jones equipment, he asks that you please reach out to him via email, which you can find on our website, wjhg.com.